All right, guys, here's your arcade. We have a, uh, a little thing we got going on here. I'm going to start from the left to right. We have this little power cord here. Um, to be able to make it to have TV out or HDMI out, you get the power cord. That power cord is going to connect to the bottom right here, this little 5 volt thing. Your HDMI cord is going to plug here, and you, you're going to wire it from there. Through there, there's a hole down, you can see straight down into the floor, and uh, you, you can wire it then to your TV. Um, the other thing is you're going to want to take this little plug right here, this VGA, in order to get the signal from the from the table to this HDMI converter to send it out. You want to you want to unplug this guy right here that says 21 21017. You're going to unplug that guy, and you're going to plug it right into this guy. That's that's your HDMI out. So, and if you want to do HDMI or I'm sorry, audio out from here. Uh, all you got to do is follow the audio cord that's inside this guy on the inner wall. There's this this green wire back here. It's a, actually a black wire with a green head, and uh, it's got a little red tape thing right there. And you unplug that guy, and you bring it right into here. You plug that guy into here. So uh, that's all you got to do. Um, so yeah, there's there's that guy. And if you want to change the orientation of your screen, now this is upside down because I'm on the other side of the table. But what we do is you come on back here, and you push. VGA, well, let me see, get this close up. VGA one is going to be your twenty one hundred and one or twenty or seventeen thousand and one, and then you have uh, VGA in two is going to be your sixty and one. So if I push this guy, this guy is your big board right now. If I push the one on the right side, that's your sixty and one. That'll allow you to play Donkey Kong Miss Pac Man head to head. So it changes the orientation of your screen. This is just a test mode for us, but just to give you an idea of where we're at. So. Um, Anyway, just wanted to give you guys a little insight on that. And then uh, I'm going to walk around real quick. I have your HDMI cable right here. And this guy isn't even done yet. It still has a little bit of trimming we got to do still. But here's your uh, extra long HDMI cable. And uh, here's your, your control panel. Now, this guy here is going to allow you to uh, push the button and add coins. I'm going to run, run around real quick and do this. Uh, you're going to add coins here. Push this button. And you hear the little ding. Now you do also have a volume knob right here. There's a volume control knob, and you can hook up uh, um, uh, what is it, headphones and everything to it right here. So that's going to be cool. Uh, we still got to blow this thing out. It's kind of dusty. Don't mind the dust. And let's turn this light off real quick. So then what you do is that you can actually go down and find your game. Um, now we do have a remote that comes with the uh, with the with the machine. And you could access your menus. You can access all kinds of stuff with this guy. So you can then, uh, you know, change your your everything from sharp your sharp uh, imaging, your contrast brightening, backlight, you know, brightness. I'm sorry, not brightening, bright, uh, brightness, and uh, and all that stuff. So I'll jump into a game here. It's any random game here. I'll give you a little little walk around what the machine looks like. So. It has little speaker holes and stuff down below, so that's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, and if, you, if you'd like uh, to really help air out the system, being that the, the system is a, it's got a PCB board inside, you could leave the back door off just to allow for proper airflow. We do have these vents here and fans inside, but sometimes it's not enough. You just want to make sure you, it gets proper airflow. So if you're not, if you don't have it exposed, not a big deal. Um, if it's in the middle of a room where you can put the door on, but uh, but if you know if you have any freezing problems or something, let us know. We'll just send you a different a different door or something, or you just take off the back door. Just allow allow for proper airflow. But uh, here's the game. I'll have uh, start this guy up, and you could get it going. You could hear this guy play. And apparently we don't have the sound on yet. There you go. Gotta move the dial knob. There it is. The volume knob was low. <laughs> so you have some pretty good sound in this guy. It's really awesome. Obviously, it's the upgraded package, so you have a good, good, nice uh, eight-inch sub inside, and it makes a heck of a difference when playing games like Street Fighter and that. So, anyway, wanted to make it a short, short video, kind of show you that guy, and uh, it's pretty awesome. You're gonna be able to finish. We should be done with this guy in a few, uh, few minutes here. So, we'll talk to you later. Hope you like it.